hey guys so last night went pretty smooth um it wasn't that bad i kept waking up throughout the night but overall I slept good so today we are going to i have no idea i have no idea what we're doing so i'm not even going to attempt to tell y'all so i don't know what we're doing but um i know we have to leave soon before the lady comes and it's super weird because i hear like the other people who are staying in the hostel like they're in the kitchen But yeah, um, so we're about to leave. This lighting is really nice and don't mess a lot of justice. But yeah, um, I will talk to y'all later. Ciao. Okay, so um, we're on the way to get breakfast because even though the place provides breakfast, um, me and Haley technically don't reside there, so we don't know if we can just, you know, eat. So that's what we're looking for, a nice little cafe. So this was the first museum we went to yesterday and it was like the remains of a castle. It was really cool. I love the painting and artwork and all of that. So I had so much fun. Look at the details. Oh goodness. Oh my goodness. So I'm pretty convinced that the grown Italian men have a thing for me because here at the museum this one of the old workers like followed me into one of the rooms and was like where are you from and I was like Georgia and he was like talking to me and the whole time literally he was like giving me that stare I was just like oh my gosh and then none of my friends were in there so I just had to hold the conversation with him and then he was like okay goodbye like but yeah, I was really weirded out and didn't know what to do. So I just tried to be nice and smile like. So we just left the museum and at the museum we bought these like little Verona cards, which is basically you buy this card for like 18 euros and then you could go see museums, like shows, parks, all these things for just that flat rate. And it is getting pretty toasty outside. I'm pretty sure it's 75 degrees or something around that. But um, yeah, it feels great. Better than Georgia weather. I can tell you that because my dad told me it's raining every day in Georgia for the next eight days. Doesn't that suck? We're on the way to Juliet's Wall because Verona is the place where Shakespeare, Romeo and, Romeo and Juliet happened. So we're going to the wall and they're supposed to write love letters and like put it in the wall. And me and Morgan are going to write our husbands a letter and then, you know, maybe we'll find somebody. What's up, y'all? This is me and my bae, Shakespeare. Say hello to the vlog. Hello, science vlog. I'm pretty sure he doesn't sound like that, but. So this is the balcony that Shakespeare used in his original play, Romeo and Juliet. Yeah. Well, <laughs> wealthy man to love <laughs> me. <laughs> That's it. Short and sweet. <laughs> it's some sort of tradition to go up to Juliet's statue and touch her boob. 
So um, I didn't get a chance to do that. So this is me just. <laughs> So we just left the wall, and um, pretty sure I'm gonna find my husband now. Pretty sure, whether it's out here or back in America, I know for certain that I'm gonna find my husband. But um, yeah, we're starving, so uh, we're trying to stop, find some pizza, you know, and then have some pasta later. But um, right now, the mission is to find a pizza. So for lunch, I tried to try wine for the culture, and uh, yeah, I hated it. I hated it. <laughs> So we walked back to our hostel to find out that the lady is in our room checking the in. So we couldn't go in. So we're in Burger King to relax and sit down because we have been walking and standing all day. I promise you, we did so much today. But after we get back, I'm going to sleep my life away. And then we're gonna wake up and go to dinner. And then do God knows what, but I'm just so exhausted. Well, we're finally about to leave Burger King after sitting and chatting for over an hour. So hopefully the lady's gone so we can go back and I can sleep my life away because I'm still exhausted since I didn't get to sleep. So it is 8.57 and I just woke up from my nap. And I changed into something basic. Yup. Probably gonna put those on later, but we have to walk to dinner. So I decided to wear sandals. Um, we're supposed to be going to some family owned Italian restaurant. So yeah. Push. So you guys, um, we're going to Chick-fil-A, the closest place is um, New York. <laughs> I know where we're going next weekend. <laughs> we could probably walk if we want. Like, you guys, imagine a Chick-fil-A sandwich. You get really emotional about it. 12 count. Oh Stop! Arnold Palmer. <laughs> so the like last one I had was disgusting, so... We're gonna try this Valpocile di Pasco. Valpocello. Okay. Okay. I'll be sad if you don't like this. You pour the oil. It's not as bad as the other one. I can drink this, but. <laughs> So this is Corte Moshi and that is a white one. <laughs> this one isn't bad. It tastes way better than the other one, but it's not bad. Um, we just got back our bill and we saw that we had to pay for silverware and the napkin that they put on the table. Where do they do that at? Where? First day in Verona down. We did a ton today. We went to the museums, we went to Juliet's Wall, we went to a castle, a good food. Ooh, I had black linguine at dinner. Found out that was squid ink. I'm glad I found that out after I finished it. But yeah, um, Italians are way nicer 
to Americans and Germans. The town is so much prettier. It's just so much to, oh, I don't know. I just love it here. I really don't want to go back. I just love it here. There's so much to do. I'm not saying that there's not much to do in Germany. But literally, there's just so much to do here. And I'm just loving it. I'm just, everything we do, like every time we turn our corner or something, it's just like, oh, oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I have to go here. I have to go here. Tomorrow, we're supposed to finish up and use our Verona card before it expires at 1 p.m. because we only got the 24 hour card. So we're gonna go to the arena and a few other museums that we can fit in. And then I think maybe we're gonna go to Garda, just like 40 minutes outside of where we're staying. And it's like this beautiful castle. And it has like this water, it's supposed to be clearer than the Bahamas. You're supposed to be able to look in the water and see the bottom. Don't know how true that is, but um, yeah, we'll see. And, um, yeah, I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Good night.